Come out tonight Good and support the game. Trojans. Even though if you're not coming to the basketball game, the buy round ticket. Come and I'm Cody Van Hoosier. Come out tonight. You know, last night it was the Park Hill Boys versus Liberty basketball game, um, but it was much more than just a basketball game last night. It was coaches versus cancer. On the coaches' team, there were students, parents, and the community. And as they raffled off several items, including a 42-inch TV at halftime, won by sophomore Drew Hendricks. The money raised would go towards cancer research. Park Hill lost in the final score, unfortunately, but won in the round in the fight against cancer. As a cancer survivor, I can say that it was great to see the community come together for that last night. Court warming dance guest permission slips are available in the attendance and reception. The form must be completed and submitted to the activities office by Wednesday, February 8th before a ticket is purchased. Guests must be enrolled in a high school and must be at least 15 years of age and less than 21 years of age. Tickets on sale January 21st. Make sure to point due south from the lobby for compass testing, which continues today at 3 o'clock in the library computer lab. See Ms. Doorward in the A-plus office about dual credit eligibility and to reserve a space for testing. Spanish Club, please bring $7 for your t-shirts to Miss Rachel's room by this Thursday, January 26. You must pay the $7 before you can order the shirt. Also, do not forget to bring your supplies for the salsa party this Thursday. Our club will meet this Thursday, January 26 in room 542. Math Club meets today after school in room 300. And add one more club announcement to that. Conservation Club will meet Thursday after school in room 520. Be sure to come and get a pass for club pictures and help plan the spring activities. Crew meetings for the spring play continues this week after school. Makeup crew and house staff meets on Thursday. Everyone is welcome. Please see Ms. Sandow in room 540 for more information. In dual credit enrollment, like I was telling you earlier, the forms are due this Friday, January 27th, to Ms. Dorward in the A-plus office. And, you know, we don't have enough time for the rest of the club announcements, so make sure that you look at our live crawl just underneath us right now. If you, have, if you didn't hear your club's name, then make sure you see when you guys meet tomorrow. It is getting cold, and I'm sad. <laughs> I had to wash my coat yesterday. Which I was that was probably a good thing. But um, anyways, Paxton, tell me what, what, tell me what I'm going to have to be wearing within the next couple of weeks. What's the weather looking like? All right, well, all the wonderful maps are up now. Surprise, surprise. Um, it's actually looking really nice around Kansas City. Uh, right around town, it's about 49 degrees, 46 to the south, uh, 43 over in Kansas, you know. Nothing major, actually. You know, you don't have to wear a heavy coat. Just a simple jacket will suffice today. And as for the rest of the week, on into the weekend... Tomorrow, high of 53, low of 31. It's going to be sunny. Awesome. Friday, it's going to be a little bit cloudy with a high of 53 and a low of 28. And Saturday, the weekend finally here, what everybody's looking for, there will be a high of 46, a low of 27. Sure to be a sunny day. Feeling a little bit of change in temperature in here, actually. I don't know what's going on. Why don't we go back to you guys at the news desk? What's up, Park Hill? I'm Sung Ha. And I'm Hannah Turner, and we're from Park Hill South. We have a short message for you, so listen up. We beat you in football and wrestling, and we're here to do it again in our house. See you guys Friday. See you at 7 at our house. Go, Go Panthers. Panthers! You know, you guys must be glad that we're on camera.